KMTV 3 News Now this morning. Well, good morning. I'm Emily Zing. Today is Monday, August 14th. It's back to school for Millard Public Schools this morning. But as 3 News Now reporter Maya Sines explains, the district is not in the best place financially. Maya? Yep, good morning. Good morning, Emily. We are live at Nihar Elementary, and in a few hours, staff will be welcoming students and their parents for their first day of school. Now, although it's an exciting day for students, the school district is starting out the school year with major funding issues. Now, the district is facing major budget cuts and starting the school year with a $6 million deficit. The budget cuts are coming to the district due to lack of government funding. 50 teachers and administrators have already been cut while the district continues to grow. The balance of the balance of smaller classrooms could also be at risk. Millard Public School officials have had two meetings with parents earlier this month informing parents of the issues and proposed placing a nine cent levy override before voters in November. Now, at placing that nine cent levy override on the school for the school district would generate about an additional nine million dollars for the district, which officials hope would help the district from cutting any more school programs. Reporting live, Maya Science, 3 News Now.